The River of Blood in Russia, officially known as the Deccan River, flows near a city in the vast expanse of Siberia. Its notoriety arose dramatically in 2016 when distressing images and videos surfaced online, revealing a shocking transformation. The river's tranquil waters had turned a vivid shade of crimson. This unsettling phenomenon captured global attention and triggered widespread concern. The unsettling red hue was not a natural occurrence, but the consequence of a significant environmental mishap. A nearby nickel processing plant, operated by Norilsk Nickel, a leading global producer of nickel and palladium, suffered a catastrophic chemical spill. The incident stemmed from a breach in a containment pond, allowing a deluge of toxic waste laden with heavy metals such as iron, nickel, and copper to pour unchecked into the river. The impact was catastrophic for the local ecosystem, endangering aquatic life and threatening the health of surrounding communities. The incident prompted swift action from Russian authorities, who launched investigations into the causes and repercussions of the spill. Norilsk Nickel faced intense scrutiny, drawing criticism and legal repercussions for its role in the environmental disaster. Efforts were made to mitigate the immediate damage through cleanup operations, yet concerns lingered about the long-term ecological consequences. The incident underscored the fragility of our natural environment in the face of industrial activities and raised profound questions about environmental stewardship and corporate responsibility. As communities and environmentalists continue to monitor the river's recovery, the legacy of the Deccan River spill serves as a poignant reminder of the enduring threats posed by industrial pollution. It stands as a stark example of the ongoing challenges in safeguarding our waterways and preserving the delicate balance of nature against the backdrop of industrial development.